everybody what's up it's kiki and welcome back for another video if you're not already subscribed to my channel make sure you hit that subscribe button and become part of the kiki squad and i want to say hello to the kiki squad i am so sorry i've been gone and that is what this video is all about telling you guys where i've been why i've been missing from youtube and all that stuff so if you guys are interested in this little quick get ready with me and info about what's been going on in my life keep watching i'm doing a little quick get ready with me because i'm getting ready to head out but I wanted to come back. I didn't just want to post a video and not explain where I've been, what I've been up to, and all that kind of stuff. Because I have been missing off YouTube for a little bit. Y'all, excuse me. Throughout this whole video, I have something in my teeth, which really, really annoyed me through editing this video. So, so I hope it doesn't annoy you guys as much as it annoyed me. But yeah, let's get on with the video. Let me start my face because I feel like exposed. Exposed. So I've already done my brows because they need to be done so bad. And I've already washed my face and all that stuff. So I'm just going to go ahead and apply some moisturizer. So I have been like really, really needing a break. Um, not from just YouTube, just a break in general. Um, I've been doing YouTube for a long time and I've never taken a real break from YouTube. Like I've taken a couple days, might not post for a week, but I've never taken like a real break. And I don't think I've recorded a video in probably like a month and a half. I'm taking this old Henriksen um, banana bright face primer and prime my face but I haven't taken a break from YouTube ever and I needed a little break and my body my mind my spirit all just shut down for a, a good couple weeks like um I hate saying that I was depressed but I was depressed depressed stressed like I broke out um, I stayed in bed for weeks at a time, had no motivation to do anything except get up, take a shower, get back in the bed. And when I did find energy to do something, I just wanted to spend it with like my family and stuff. So if you follow me on Instagram, you probably see me post that I went out and stuff, but I really wasn't doing much. I go out every like now and then just to make myself get out the house. Um, I know like um, you can't say the S word on YouTube and I really don't believe at all that I was the S word but the shade room had posted like this because it was like the S word awareness month so they had posted this chart of signs to look look out for and like in each category I saw things that you know I was going through and I was like hold up let me let me get myself together because that's not that's not me that's not where I'm going as far as not wanting to be here anymore that's far from the truth so I definitely wanted to get myself together. So I'm just gonna take this um, Hourglass Stick Foundation, which is almost done, and use this kind of to like color correct my hyperpigmentation. These acne scars I done got. I got like so backed up on my videos. I, I haven't even checked emails. I've been like just out of it. Um, last weekend, I finally felt up to getting out the house, doing things, and I went to a pretty little thing event which you guys will see because I actually vlogged. And prior to that, um, Steven and I did like a little staycation because I needed it. And you guys will see that in the vlog as well. So I'm gonna try to start back vlogging. I hope you guys, you know, watch because a lot of you guys ask me about the vlogs a lot. So I'm gonna try to start back vlogging. And like I have like so many videos from vlogs that I've done. But if you guys still want to see it, let me know. Like, it's footage from when we went to the Bahamas. It's footage from when we went to Bush Gardens for Stephen's birthday. Other than that, business has been going well. Thank you all so, so much for supporting Cotton Candy Eyelashes. We have been doing way better than I expected. And I really, really appreciate it. Right now, we're running a sale by two, get one free. So, if you guys want to go snatch you up some Cotton Candy Eyelashes, I will have a link in the description box you guys can go check it out get you some lashes if you guys wanted to try them out i'm just using this juvia's place foundation and lego lagos lagos so yeah let me know if you guys have ever experienced something like that that's the worst that i've ever felt i don't know i think my body just needed a break because i haven't taken one and you know like if you stay at home or if you're a stay at home mom stay at home housewife or you're an entrepreneur content creator whatever if you stay in the house all the time and don't really get out into the world your body becomes accustomed to that and like that's what i feel like was happening like i just didn't want to go out just wanted to lay in the bed i'm good now i'm like at 90 percent. i would say 90 percent. even me sitting here recording this video 
it's big goals because I wasn't even able to sit in one spot to do something. Every time I sit down to try to do anything, I wanted to go get in the bed. So just me sitting here recording this video is big for me. Let me know what you guys want to see from me. I know you guys want to see videos with Steven. And like I said, I am going to be vlogging more. So you guys will have a vlog up, I think this week, or I'm not sure when I'm going to upload it. I'm not sure if I'm going to do a monthly vlog or if I'm just going to go back to weekend vlogs. But I definitely want to start back vlogging. I need a new camera because my camera is acting a donkey. I'm trying out some new concealer from CoverGirl. This is the something concealer. Y'all know I don't got my glasses on. I can't see. Oh, I kind of like this concealer. I like the shade. And I had no one other than Steven to really vent to or tell what was going on. I'm always that person that people call to tell their problems to or tell their business to and for me to take on their problems and all that stuff. But I don't have people who I can call and tell, you know, I'm going through something or, or even people who call to check up on me when I'm not available for them. I don't have no one. So... I kind of went through that. That's I think that's why it took so long for me to get out of that because I really had nobody to talk to about it. Mm. I like this concealer. It reminds me of Shape Tape. So I'm going to use the darker shade too. One of my goals for this year was to start therapy. Um, not because of you know depression or anything like that. It's just because I have so much stuff that I need to deal with from my childhood that interferes with my adulthood so one of my goals this year was to go to counseling but I haven't done anything about it yet so maybe that's something that I need to do mm -mm. I hate these brushes like this oh it dry fast honey honey wait 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 when thank you to everybody who reached out to me like um Kiki what's going on I haven't seen you you haven't posted videos the videos you have posted it's been voiceovers that's all I can bear. <laughs> so I'm back. And I feel so much better. This is the Fenty Powder and Honey, I think that's what it is. I'm just going to warm my face up with my Fenty Bronzer and Mocha Mommy. If I ever feel like that again, I'm definitely going to seek some help for it. Because like I said, that was the first time I ever felt like that. So I ain't know where that was coming from. So I'm going to go pop on some lashes and I'll be right back. Right now I'm wearing my new lashes in Miami Girl. Um, I have a few new lash styles dropping really, really soon. And you know I have to test them out before I launch them. So I've worn these a few times and I love them. I like wearing long lashes but not like super thick lashes. And these lashes, I like wearing lashes like this out. I used to only wear my natural lash styles out. But I wear my more dramatic uh, styles out so that people will ask me about my lashes and I can tell them about my website. So that's pretty much it. I'm going to put on a little bit of light blush. This is Peaches by MAC. Just a little bit of color. I'm doing the most just to go to my brother-in-law house. But I can get a good picture today. And that's always good. And I'm just using this old Bobbi Brown highlighter and bronze glow one of my favorites I stopped using it to use other stuff then when I go back to it I'm like oh why and because I'm uploading this video first before I upload any other videos this hair I do have a video on this is from Ali Pearl I've reviewed for them a couple times and I really really like their hair this is a wig of course I've had it on for a couple days I don't even know how long I had it on for probably like five days four or five days and I just have it on with the Boho Active. And I am going to take it out when I come home tonight. So I'm not going to style it or flat iron it or anything. So one of my plans is to get out the house more often. Um, do things. Even if I just go to Starbucks just to get out the house. I think I'm in the house too much. And it all just came down on me and I crashed. I was also going through it because one day I woke up and I had like 30, 40 emails from YouTube. The copyright claim was filed on my intro music, the Kiki Do You Love Me? And that was just like, ugh, now what? Yeah, that had me like kind of bummed out too. So all that was happening at one time. But I'm definitely on a better path now. 
thank you jesus so i have quite a few videos coming up for you guys um my hair i'm going to be doing a video on my hair my natural hair a pretty little thing fashion of clothing try on haul steven will be in uh, i'm trying to get them in both then make sure you guys go check out cotton candy eyelashes and yeah get you some lashes buy two get one free right now with the coupon code get one free like I said, I'll have it in the description box. I gotta hurry up and get out of here. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for all your support over the years. All you guys is well wishes that I know you guys are gonna send me. I love you guys so, so much. And I miss you guys so, so much. So make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up, comment, share, all that good stuff. I have so much content coming for you guys. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.